Alright guys, so I've been running the mill for about, I think I got about 12 hours running these parts. And I've created a nice little pile of shavings over here. I just piled it up over in the corner so it could kind of drain. Uh, and I've oiled the ways about three different times, uh, about every four hours. And so I just wanted to kind of see what kind of accumulation of oil I ended up with in my coolant. And you can kind of see a neat thing that's happening is because of the way this dam is, it keeps all the oil in this side. And then because the oil floats to the top, it stays collected up here. And it doesn't get back into the actual coolant which is really nice and so inside the coolant here I don't have any oil floating so that's pretty cool um, I'm really happy with this pump system the only problem is it is a little bit small because it seems like uh, Every time I come to run the mill, I have to add about at least a gallon of coolant. I know I'm losing some from evaporation, and then, you know, some just kind of stays in the mill, but I wanted to kind of point that out. I'm going to clean this out and then uh, continue on. So for those considering this pump, um, pump and the dam is really nice I really this is really nice because it kind of keeps the oil uh, separated which is really nice you don't need a skimmer you just clean this out every few days or so and then the only thing that I would rather have is maybe about five gallons if I could have a gallon and a half more on the size I think I would be a lot happier but overall pretty satisfied with it just an update on the coolant pump so thanks for watching the video please feel free to comment if you have any questions thumbs up if you like the video please subscribe and most importantly be safe <laughs>